Hi, my name is Trina Larson. I'm 17 years old. One of the biggest concerns I've heard about the legalization of recreational marijuana is that the impact it will have on teens. Since I've heard so many adults speak for the youth, I figure it's time I'd speak for myself. I do not believe that legalization of recreational cannabis will change the rate of consumption by youth. As long as the way that marijuana is legalized strictly prohibits it for students, the incentive to use it will not change. For the, those of us under 21, the legality of it will not change. Legalization will, however, change the world of cannabis for those choosing to use it illegally already. At the moment, the only way for anyone to obtain marijuana for recreational reasons would be through the black market. Everyone in Vermont knows <laughs> that what else comes with that. Um, exposure to the black market includes physically addictive and life-changing drugs, including amphetamines, cocaine, heroin, and more. At the moment, for youth to procure alcohol, they would have to find someone over 21 willing to purchase them booze legally for illegal consumption. These purchases are tracked and monitored. So if the alcohol is abused by the minors, this, um, the controlled system of sales, would, um, its source would be able to be found. This controlled system of sales would make any adult more hesitant to involve themselves with illegal youth consumption. Marijuana at the moment isn't like this. It can be found on the black market almost anywhere. And the people selling it do not care if the youth get into trouble because there's no way to track the purchases besides word of mouth. These people also expose youth to other drugs because much like any other business owner, they look to expand their business. Because of the black market, marijuana is a much easier and dangerous drug to get than alcohol. The last point I would like to make is on the education of marijuana. In my sophomore year of high school, the health teacher told the class that if marijuana is legalized, women will use it, it will mess with their hormones, cause them to drive recklessly and get into accidents. I am not exaggerating, and I'm not kidding. And neither was he. Um, there are no facts I could find to back up this statement. This is just one example of the misinformation provided in schools. Marijuana is taught in the same way that cocaine or heroin is taught. We are told simply not to use it. The health, meanwhile, we are taught the health risks of smoking cigarettes and fully informed so we can make an educated decision on whether or not we decide to use it when we reach the legal age. Alcohol is the same way. Because marijuana is taught with a just say no attitude, children are left uninformed if and when they are exposed to it. I have also heard the story of many youth who, after experimenting, discovered facts be different than what they thought. So legalize it and put money towards education.